Hi everyone. Well, for my update today, I have my Christmas cactus here in my office and it's beautiful red flowers that have started to bloom is a wonderful reminder to us that we are entering into Advent season. So for this week's update, I wanted to let you know about some important ministry events that are coming up as we enter into the Advent season. And I also wanted to give you a brief update, financial update on our giving to date. Well, to begin, I want to invite you out to an evening of praise and worship this Saturday here at the church at 6 uh, p.m. We'll go from 6 to 8 p.m. And Juanita and I will be co-hosting along with NICE, and we will also have a few guests, musicians joining us. It'll be a, a lively time of cross-cultural worship and celebration. Well, I'm also very excited to begin our new Advent Sermon Series. This Sunday, I've entitled it Living Christmas. We will be looking at what it means to live and, uh, live and celebrate uh, the true message of Christmas in an ever-increasing secularized culture. The December 12th service will be a special one. In particular, it's our family Christmas service and the kids from Power Up and Arise are working diligently to prepare a, a great time of worship with drama and puppets and singing. And uh, Pastor Jamal will be um, bringing a salvation message. So it's gonna be a real special service. Unfortunately, due to COVID-19, uh, we need to postpone Soup and Carols for another year, sadly. Um, Lord willing, we'll be able to meet again in 2022. We'll be hosting two candlelight Christmas Eve services this year, one at 4 p.m. and the other at 5.30 p.m. Both services will be about an hour long. Please be in prayer for all our Advent celebrations this year that Christ will be glorified and people will be drawn closer to him through the moving and blessing of the Holy Spirit. Well, lastly, I want to thank you for your faithful and generous giving here at Still Heights. As we draw closer to the end of the calendar year, you may want to know where you're at in terms of your giving so far at Still Heights in 2021. So the finance team has asked Jerry Semler, our financial secretary, to print out in confidence uh, a personal giving report for your year-to-date giving. These reports will be available for pickup on Sunday, December 5th at either the Welcome Center or we'll place them in the, your mail slot in the, lo in the lobby. Um, this is not your, your 2021 tax receipt. Jerry will have those ready uh, for you in early February 2022. Well, currently we are about $30,000 short of our budget uh, four months into the ministry year, which runs from August 1st to July 31st, 2022. Um, our overall faith goal in the 21-22 budget is $833,727 for the church and $676,344 for the Early Learning Center for a total of $1.6 million. Now that may seem like uh, some big numbers for us as a church, but I believe that back in May, uh, at our vision night, when the membership approved the ministry budget, we were following God's will. And here's the thing. God has been so faithful to the people of Still Heights through the years. And I believe that he will continue to provide for us, not only financially, but in every aspect of our lives and ministry here at Still Heights. Well, may the Lord bless you and your families this Christmas as you celebrate the coming of Christ and the hope we have through him. And as always, I look forward to joining you all for worship this Sunday online and in person. Bye for now.